Hello, this is old Mr. Kent of MrKent.com, and I had a question from a friend about his uh, Mini 2 not returning to home when he had pressed the button for it to return to home. And I got to thinking, you know, I've never checked out my map, my uh, DJI Mini 2 to, to see if, even if it did return to home when I hit the button. And so I thought, I better check and see if mine returns to home. So I'm taking off here. I'm going to run my first test to make sure that uh, my drone is working like it's supposed to. And so I'm going to get up to, uh, he said he, t he got up to 120 feet. And so I, I'm trying to duplicate his situation. So I set my, uh, my return to home altitude, if you noticed, to 120 feet. And now I'm going to fly down the road a little ways. And uh, when I get far enough away that uh, it'll make a good test. Uh, and by the way, my return to home altitude generally is about 225 or 30 feet. And that's because way off in the distance there, we have some high voltage uh, transmission lines. And they're, they're 212 or something feet high. And so uh, I want to make sure if I'm over in that area, my return to home is higher than those. And that's what you should, uh, you should go by. Anything around, uh, you measure the altitude of uh, how high it is and then set your return to home uh, to, to higher than that. And uh, so I, I'm paused here and I finally hit the return to home button. And it's going to head back to where I'm standing down there, at least close anyway. And, you know, generally, uh, high-voltage transmission lines, the ones that have the arms sticking out look like a robot, my grandson calls them. <laughs> They're about 125 feet tall. And then a standard uh, power pole is around about, well, 50 to 60 feet tall. And then uh, uh, cell phone towers are generally around 70 feet tall. And so those are some, some rules to go by if you haven't measured the altitude of things around you. But you should always check things out around you. Make sure that your return to home altitude is higher than the items that you're going to be flying around. And as you can see, my return to home is working fine. And so before it tries to land in the dirt, <coughs> I'm going to stop the, I'm going to cancel the, uh, the landing. And then I'll land on my <clears throat> on my uh, folding pad and then uh, as soon as I get landed I'll start over and uh, we'll try try uh, my friend's his name is Dave try what he did he went uh, from his uh, I think it was his backyard and he went straight up a hundred and twenty feet and uh, that was his return to home altitude and then he was checking to see if return to home worked so we're gonna uh, we're gonna duplicate that. So here I am. I'm landing, and the nice thing is it it landed in the same direction that it took off closely. Of course, I turned a little bit. So we're gonna take off again here, and I'm right on the edge of the uh, uh, Phoenix Mesa uh, airport. So uh, I always get that little warning. I'm gonna take off, and I'm gonna climb. As you'll notice, I'm climbing up to. Uh, uh, I'll stop at 120 feet. And then I'm going to hit the return to home, and you're going to notice I get a, you'll note, you'll note that I get a notice that return to home isn't going to work because the drone has to be at least 20 meters right there. It's unavailable because it has to be at least 20 meters away from the return to home point. And so uh, it canceled, but it's still remembering that uh, I want it to return to home. So now I'm going to uh, go ahead and I'm going to fly forward. Uh, everything is fine. I'm going to fly forward and go to uh, some distance away. And you'll notice as soon as it hits 20 meters uh, distance away, it's going to automatically start returning to home, just like as if uh, like it did when I went up the road. So the objective here is to uh, remember return to home only works if it's not near the uh, return to home point. So uh, I hope that answers the question for my friend Dave. 
I hope it answers the question for anybody else who who might have run into that and gets kind of worried because uh, the DJI's got it figured out. I guess it doesn't make any sense to to uh, do a return to home if you're already right over <laughs> right over the spot. So uh, and I did that just this morning, and so I'll get it published, and then uh, uh, everyone who's had that problem will be able to. Uh, to identify with it and understand why it happened. So anyway, I want to thank you for watching my videos as always, and God bless. <laughs>